Acrylic art is a new development for Australian Aboriginal people, whose ancient traditional painting was only previously done ceremonially in ochres, on rock walls, bodies, artefacts and in the sand. The modern movement began in the early 1970s with outback community school mural projects in the central desert at Papanya and Yundamu, which introduced new materials. The artists began to make more permanent artworks on boards and canvas, using an existing system of symbols to illustrate their country and dreamings. Soon artists from other communities began to produce acrylic artworks. The popularity of the art quickly grew, and with the potential of extra income for the artists, their numbers flourished. Traditional ceremonies and cultural practices are a continual source of inspiration for the creation of magnificent artworks full of spiritual and cultural significance. A new style has emerged from the desert of Central Australia into the contemporary art world, where the power and beauty of the works and images have driven the new art movement of the century. This option will be based on the Dreamtime images of the Australian Aborigines. The Aborigines believe that every person essentially exists eternally in the dreaming. This eternal part existed before the life of the individual begins and continues to exist when the life of the individual ends. Both before and after life, it is believed that this spirit child exists in the dreaming and is only initiated into life by being born through a mother. The spirit of the child is culturally understood to enter the developing fetus during the fifth month of pregnancy. When the mother felt the child move in the womb for the first time, it was thought that this was the work of the spirit of the land in which the mother then stood. Upon birth, the child is considered to be a special custodian of that part of his country and is taught the stories and song lines of that place. In the Aboriginal worldview, every event leaves a record in the land. Everything in the natural world is a result of the past, present, and future actions of the archetypal creator beings, whose actions are continuously creating the world. The meaning and significance of particular places and creatures is wedded to their origin in the dreaming, and certain places have a particular potency, which the Aborigines call its dreaming. In this dreaming resides the sacredness of the earth.